Okay, we're back. That's that <laughs> iconic scene from the 1998 version of The Parent Trap. You probably know the story. So twin sisters masterminding the reunion and eventual remarriage of their divorced parents. I've seen that 700 times. At Even least. more than me, yeah. girls. Okay, the script isn't just a Hollywood creation. Scott Gady and Julie Shore divorced nearly 10 years ago. But in 2021, their daughters noticed a little spark reignite and a new adventure began. So they're all here live. We're excited. Just two weeks after Scott and Julie celebrated their second wedding. We're going to chat with them in just a moment. But first, check out their incredible story. If you're new here, my parents are divorced, but they're getting remarried. Some might say you'd have to believe in magic if you ever thought Scott Gady and Julie Shore would ever get back together. Started this account in the phase of their divorce where they were very much like not friends, not pals, not vibing in any way. The couple's daughters, Rachel and Caroline, have racked up millions of views on TikTok. How did you meet? Documenting their parents' second chance at love. Are you guys holding hands right now? Scott and Julie divorced nearly a decade ago, started new lives of their own while co-parenting. That changed during the pandemic while caring for elderly parents. The family of four found themselves in the same quarantine bubble. My parents were still like definitely separate, but it was, it was nice to see them like getting along. The sisters picked up on something their parents had not yet realized. This is the notorious photo that we call the parent trap photo. We were like, our parents like each other. So Rachel and Caroline began teasing their parents, joking with the mom that she still had deep feelings for their dad. Julie realized her daughters were right. After a trip away, Scott and Julie decided to move in together. One year later, with some consistent encouragement, Scott proposed to Julie once again. What are we doing? We're going to go shop for dresses, and we're going to go... What dresses? Oh, yeah, my wedding dress. And just like the movie's ending, sealing their everlasting love. We actually did it. Yeah, Caroline oh. and Rachel actually did it. They're here with the newlyweds, Julie and Scott. Guys, this is such a beautiful story. Well, first, how's newlywed life? You guys have been married for how many weeks? Since You're getting this? A couple no. of weeks. <laughs> a couple of weeks? Yeah, yeah. How's it been going? I good. think really good. <laughs> <laughs> is this super weird, this yeah, whole it, situation? Yeah, it is a little bit weird. Yeah. But, you know, I think it's the girls just left after being home for us, like a bit of time. So, like, mm -hmm. literally, we're just now. Like, okay, yeah, this is it. I, we're married. Yeah. Yeah. Again, this is I kind of like how you guys had to be forced together because of COVID. And you guys, let's be honest, you weren't friends. You weren't, you, you weren't oh, no. on good terms. <laughs> and yet here you guys found yourself in the COVID bubble together. Yeah. That was um, a super challenging time, mm -hmm. I think. Um, but for my mom, mm -hmm. we wanted to make sure we were staying safe. And she's actually watching right now. So oh, oh, grandma. She's <laughs> grandma. <laughs> so she kind of brought you together. So yeah. you wanted to stay safe, be in one place. Mm -hmm. Scott, obviously you want to be with your girls. So suddenly you're thrust together. Yeah. Rachel, when, like, how did you start noticing that there's like, maybe not even just, oh. there's no more animosity. Yeah. Now there's yeah. a friendliness. Wait, is this romance we're yeah. detecting? It wasn't for a while. It wasn't until, I would say, almost a year after COVID. COVID was just when they became, like, friendly with each other, which was new enough mm -hmm. in itself. Um, and I would say it wasn't until, like, 2021 that we were like, what's going on here? <laughs> what, what's happening? Did yeah. you notice or were you kind of encouraging, Caroline? What was the what was happening here? I think, if anything, they kind of parent trapped themselves. I think Rachel <laughs> and I were better at highlighting the differences in the dynamic the second time around, but I think that they definitely got themselves in What did situation. you notice? What were some of the first things you noticed? Well, I know there was one time where mom was getting all blushy and, like, school girly because <laughs> Rachel was like, you have a crush on dad, and I know it. She ran into the other room. <laughs> <laughs> that was kind of the telling point where we do. Oh my gosh. Well, Scott, I mean, look, it's, this is not a traditional nope. trajectory <laughs> at all. So from your perspective, what happened? How'd you fall back in love? So part of it, uh, right after COVID, within the next year, my parents had passed away. Rachel graduated from college. Caroline was graduating from high school. So in addition to COVID, right on the tail out, we just had this tremendous amount of time pressured together that kind of forged us into who we are now. I think you guys are probably different than you were back then. Have you noticed, like, why it works now and why it didn't work then, do you think? Um, that's a whole show, I think. <laughs> <laughs> 
But honestly, like, you know, we say that that divorce period, our separation period is really part of our marriage mm -hmm. and it's made us oh. into who we are today. And that's why it works today. We're, so we're much different now. There's no way we could have been the people we were five years ago. There's no way those two people could have gotten remarried. Mm -hmm. Can you believe what y'all did, by the way? <laughs> Your little social media thing really turned this into a huge sensation, didn't I know. it? It's, it's, been, it's been absolutely <laughs> crazy, but it's it's been so much fun. And it's fun. We have our, our little community of people like rooting for us. How does it cool. feel? I mean, it's like, you know, you can, there are all kinds of families. And a yeah. family of divorced parents is still a family. And it's mm -hmm. wonderful when they can get along. Mm -hmm. But your parents got back together and they're married. Yeah. How does that feel? <laughs> it's too awesome. And I mean, like, definitely when they first got divorced, obviously it's more sad at the beginning. But I think we definitely got to a point where they went their separate ways. We were all happy our separate ways. But coming back together, it was clear that they were even happier. And so it was just, that's the better How bet. was that wedding, by the way? Was it pretty amazing? It was, perfect. Perfect. It was amazing. It was, perfect. Wanted, yeah. Yeah. It was yeah. exactly the right thing. Wow. Um, that's yeah. awesome. We'll keep the videos coming. Scott, Please do. I think you were doing the running man and some yeah, of that video. People want more of that. I don't even have TikTok on my phone. I have to go <laughs> yeah. to her phone. Well, well, you're a TikTok star. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. We're so happy for all Thanks, of you. Guys. Thank Thanks, you guys. Thank you so much. much. And I heard you're going to be in town for an extra night. Yes. Is that right? Yeah. We thought it'd be fun if you kind of recreated mm -hmm. the iconic parent trap picture while you're here. You know this one? So guess what? We reached okay. out to the folks at City Cruises. It's a, a kind of a fun experience right here around Manhattan. And we've got a table for four. It's a glass enclosed <laughs> boat. Dinner's on them. So you'll have your nice little dinner. Yes, please do the photo op. Please. Oh, thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Thanks thank so much you. for joining us. Many, many years of good times. We wish yeah. you the best. Thank Thanks. You. Thanks. All right, Mr. Thank Roker, you. how about a check of the weather? They can then recreate the spaghetti scene in Lady and the Tramp. It'll be great. <laughs> All right. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.